Way off in the deep end like usual Niggas swear they passed us, they doing too much Haven't done my taxes, I'm too turned up Virgil got a paddock on my wrist going nuts Niggas caught me slipping once a week Hey man, what's good YouTube? It's your boy King Demar, man. Everybody like, subscribe, and comment, man. Roll to 6K subscribers, man. Roll to 100,000 subscribers also, but 6K, you know, that's a closer goal. Uh, 100K, like the, you know, like the little, like the, like the future goal, the longer goal, you know. That's just something that's farther away. That's the bigger goal that I want to accomplish, is reaching 100K. 6 go to, you know, about like 800 subscribers away. We'll get that if I stay consistent, but I can't stay consistent. It's, it's, it's a little tough being in college, and you feel me? But man, let's get into what I'm gonna be reacting to the, today. Today I'm reacting to Queen Radio Gaga. Um, the last video I did had a lot of had a lot of support. I really appreciated that. Over 200 likes, um, over 2,000 views, had like three dislikes. But I appreciate the support, man. I really do. So um. With support like that, I had no choice but to, um, you know, keep keep reacting to them. So, um, I see a lot of people request a live A in 1995. Y'all said that was like the greatest performance ever, or greatest concert ever. But some person said that I should I should continue reacting to their music before I get into that. So that's why I ain't get into that. I think that is kind of smart to let me listen to their music first, get more into reacting to them then react to that because if that's the greatest performance ever or greatest live performance or the greatest concert ever i feel like that should be like the I, I should at least wait so that's why actually why i do the live version to this song is because on the live version say radio gaga live a 1985 so that's the reason why i do the live version um and what else oh yeah and i do my research did my research on this song before i did it and it said the inspiration for this song came from Roger Taylor. He heard his son. He said he heard his son use the words radio caca while listening to a bad song on the radio while they were in Los Angeles. I know Lady Gaga credits her stage name to this song. She adored Cream and they had a hit called. And that they had a hit called Radio Gaga. Okay. So yeah. I ain't lie, it do be, it do be bad music on the radio. I ain't gonna lie. A, a lot of bad music like it'd be music like why are they even playing this on the radio so i can i can see where they come from and and back in the time it was like 1980s and that happened i started my screen recording so we finna get straight into it i saw somebody talking about how they stay logo right here but let's get straight into it let me make sure my volume up let's go i spoke for like two minutes i didn't even try to do that Bro, do this, do my audio sound bad? Like, I know, I know, like, as I get further and further into my, like, YouTube career, I want to keep improving on certain things. But do my audio sound bad? Like, I know people say I need headphones. Like, yeah, I know I need headphones to hear lyrics better. And, like, you know, music sound better with headphones on. But, like, do, does my audio really sound bad? Let me know down below. If you think about it, that's actually so true. Like everything that you be hearing, you probably hear it on the radio if you listen to your radio. They'll tell you about the weather, 
they gonna tell you about all all the drama that's going around. They gonna new music, all the hits. They gonna tell you everything you need to know on the radio. Like that is so true still to this day. This is a live concert right here when everybody clapping alone if this is a live concert man that concert was jumping man he said so don't become some background noise like a backdrop for the girls and boys who just don't know or just don't care and just complain when you're not there like man he, he speaking his he he, he he talking his talk like the way he can like i talk about his vocals every time and he's just it keeps getting better and better, man. Freddie know how to sing, bro. And it's just, man, I don't keep repeating the same thing, but my words are really gonna be really repetitive throughout every video I react to them. Cause his, he, he got nice, he just got a nice voice, man. Like, this is, like, is this a live performance? Change through the years, like that. You don't need to use your ears to to hear or see how music changed through the years. Like you still got this music video is. If I show you a music video now, it's gonna be two different things: auto tunes and live performances, or just like have the, this is everything. Like you don't need to use you don't need to use your ears to show how music have changed. Like let's see what they predict in the future, man. Is that a gas mask? And so this song do gotta be about the bad song here on the radio. Cause uh, he sound like all we hear is Radio Gaga, Radio Goo Goo, Radio Gaga. And he said again, and then he be like Radio Blah Blah. Like, then he like Radio What's New. Someone still loves you. Like, this dude gotta be a, like, this gotta be based on that bad song that he heard. Like, y'all let me know if it's something different. But that is exactly what this song gotta be about. You gotta be talking about the bad music on the radio.
Yeah, so I'm gonna say, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I like this instrumental. I like this instrumental. I'm into instrumentals a lot. I ain't gonna lie. I love these a uh, good instrumental. I know y'all said Freddie. Uh, they all get their own professions, like the own, like they own little major that they went to school for. And Freddie was a graphic designer. And this video right here, it's like so many things is going on in the video that keeps you entertaining, keeps you looking at the visuals. So that's why I like this music video because there was just so much happening that's going to keep you intrigued with the video. That's going to have you keep looking. This is a good video. I wonder, did he used to, did he used to edit their videos by himself or did they hire an editor? Because if you were graphic, if you did graphic design, you probably could have did this yourself. You at least have like a say so in how this video is going to be. I just wonder, like, since he did, since he did graphic design in school, was he editing their own videos? That's what I want to know. Cause it was a, it's just a lot of things that's going on in this video that's actually, it's actually a good thing in, in my eyes. I think with so much going on, it's gonna keep you intrigued and keep you entertained cause you just see it, you're seeing so much. So you're not gonna look away for real, for real. So that's why I like this music video. Nice instrumental, nice lyrics. It's, it's real catchy. This song is real catchy, it's probably, this is probably more catchy than the last song right to what was it? Somebody to love? This is probably more catchy than this. Um I like how the lyrics still up to date. Like like the radio still be bad. Like I don't listen to the radio because it's just sometimes they they talk more about all this mess than really play music. And a lot of the music is crazy and y'all know this. Y'all know this. Y'all probably don't even listen to new music now. So um yeah, that's really that's really all I gotta say, man. Is that the lyrics are true, still up to date. Um, spoke about the video, nice instrumental. Mm, I think that might be it, man. That might be it. But I think that's it. That might just be it. I I like what I like. Um, I, I hope that y'all keep request stuff down below. Let me know if I should get into Life Aid now or should I wait? I think I should wait, but let me know. Um, that's really it, man. Like, subscribe, and come, man. Rose one k subs, man. I love how so many people still love them to this day. Even if they all gone, rest in peace to um, every single one of them, if they are all gone. Um, I just I just like that. Like They still bring people together by that music. That's something that I like. Like, cause people, music probably the best way to bring people together. If you hear a song, you like, what you know about them? Now a conversation started, you see? Music can bring people together so easily. So that's what I like, that's what I like about um this group. I see a lot of people love them. So it can bring people together, man. So, man, that's it. Like, subscribe, comment, man. Roll to 6K subscribers, roll to 100 days. Roll to 100K subscribers, man. I'm out of here. All right, y'all. I'm in a coat full of money makers and go getters. Get it straight. I'm my biggest critic. I can make no error. What's the point of hanging on the old pines today?